What's up, everybody? This is Crypto Muscle. This is coming to you in another video. Here we are internationally now. We're watching this. We're Zach, Crypto Muscle, and Crypto Muscle Network. Coming to you with another YouTube video. And so, finally, I could kind of catch up on uh, the quantitative trading uh, programs, which consist of BTB. And of course, you guys know uh, TFVPM, right? And so this is what it's all about: TFVPM. These sort of things here. The I call this the quantitative trading sort of platforms because their means to go about it is through these kind of programs here and how they go about accumulating profit and all that. Uh, they have their way with their AI, all right? And I don't ask questions. I just, uh, you know, take it upon myself to put it in and take it out, all right? I'm here to take, put it in and take more out. So we all recognize that these kind of programs are geared towards like the quantitative trading. See, yeah, it is quantitative strategy is what it says here for uh, this particular platform. And then when you look at BTB, they have their way of doing it as well, but it's geared towards that quantitative trading as a structure very similarly, right? So, you know, I'm, I want to talk about both in this video. Both are very good options. BTB is newer. And um, the team behind it are geared towards successful platforms and making sure BTP is going to be running full steam and maximizing long-term returns. And that's what they're about, right? And so um, I just got off, you know, being part of the seven day deal here that they had going on. So, you know, there's different ones you want to go for. It's up to you, right? Uh, right now, let's see. This is update, so $500. And then what I did was, let's see if it shows here. So I earned 690, 690, 690, 690, 690, that sort of stuff. And then transfer it out earlier this morning. Um, in terms of what I got, which is, well, my $500 plus profit, right? So let's see what I could take out. If I wanted to take out, and let's just say TRT20. Let me see here. All right, so going back to here, uh, let me show you this here. So I put in 500 and then estimated income and receipt of income was 48.65. And I show you the breakdown of that. It was like six something per day that you saw there. And so I'm just gonna let it ride, you know? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back in and do it again. And that's how you do it right here. You just go to order, right? Not order. Um, is it investments? Yeah. And if you guys remember, the uniqueness of it is, you can see here the breakdown. BTC, 30 days. You need a minimum of $2,000. So that would be this right here. You hit start. ETH, 15 days, 1.55 to 1.65. $1,000 minimum here. Then you would just go here and hit start. BNB, 7 days, 1.35 to 1.45. $500 minimum. That's for BNB. And then so on and so forth, right? DOT sold, Doge, one day. All right, any three of these here, XRP, LTCHT, those three. I mean, it's decent, 1% a day, $100 minimum for three days. So, 
Uh, I've been letting it ride on the seven days, and that's why you haven't seen me talk about it. I'm just kind of letting it ride the last seven days. So that's where it's at with it. I'm going to go ahead and do that again. All right, I want to go and put in 700. Or I'm sorry, not 700, 500 plus back in there again. Let's see if that amount has hit my wallet yet. Let's see a thousand there. Not a thousand, 500 minimum, right? Should be back in my wallet. Let's see. And is it in? I think it's in. Let's see here. So when you hit unfinished, yeah, you can see that it's not there right now. Or it's in there. It's not finished yet because I just put it back in. Total of one record. You can see that. See what's completed now is the one I just completed from a week ago on 9-6. All right, so I'm trying to head over to the withdraw here and, you know, because I went to the withdraw here to TRC20, you know, here and coming up upon parameter here. I'm going to have to I'm not quite sure what that means, to be honest with you. So I'm going to have to ask, check in with support on that one um, as to why it says that um, and then kind of go from there. So for now, I'm just going to compound it. But as far as I know, the plan, the platform is working just fine. It's just uh, I'm just not understanding that part of it. So uh, with that, I'll get back to you guys on this and then. Maybe I'll do another video midweek or so just to kind of show you how to pull this out. And maybe it's something on my end that's happening. Um, yeah, because I don't know why it's doing that. I don't understand. So, I'll find out. But yeah, so that's the latest on this and, and the inner working is a how to work BTB. Uh, I think it's, a, it's slightly more complicated than TFVPM which we're going to talk about right now. So here's TFVPM, um, quantitative trading, another one. This is the original one. And there was another one that came after this and it wasn't that great. It died. It was a pro stocks. It was kind of like a sister version or brother version. And it wasn't that great. It did. It was okay, but it was, um, just didn't gain enough traction. So it died. Right. And so, uh, with that, um, something new that was added is this Falcon plan here where it's 12 hours. You're in 1.2% for 12 hours. So I guess if you do it for another 12 hours in the 24 hour day, you could earn 2.4%. So that's something that you could do here. Uh, I'm not one to mess with that. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is right here. It's kind of weird. <laughs> um... But yeah, so with that, let me show you what I got going on right now. This is, I ran this thing up to 1500 now. So every time I've gone back in, I just continue to just compound it back in again. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to actually like try to pull something out. Maybe 2000, maybe once I hit 2000, I'll start to try to pull something out. But right now I'm just going to just keep riding it and uh, pushing it. I think that's yeah I've been pushing it with this right here position is full is this the seven day one this might be the seven day one let me see three day yeah see I've been doing the seven day one and this is the no oh, that's the seven day one oh then maybe this one's the five day plan yeah this one's full yeah, they won't even take anybody 15 days there 
seven days there. And I can't even check that one. That's three days. I think that's a five day plan. So this one's full. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll just do the three days. And then I'll check back again in three days. And what I'll do from there is um, I'll give you guys the update on how to work the BTB part. Yeah, I think that's the best way to go about it. So I'm going to compound all this back in for three days. I prefer to do seven, but um, no, nah, you know what? I'm going to do seven days. Yeah, I like. I just like the. I just like the seven days because then I'm not committed, you know, to to do it in three days. There it goes. All right, so in seven days, I'll be back to pick this up again. And then um, I got a, I got a backup one, too, that I want to put myself in. So here, I'm going to go and put myself in a seven-day deal on that one, too. Yup. Ooh, it says I need greater than a 1,000. Let's see if they let me do it. It says I need greater than a thousand, so I, I, I need a thousand minimum, probably. Yeah, so that's unfortunate. Guess I'll have to cancel that one and go back. I would have made the five day one, but they're all out. It's all full. So I'm stuck to doing three days now. Unfortunately. But it's all good, though. So I did that for three days. So that's my backup one, but my main one is right here, 1512. So that's where it's at here. So sometime in the middle of this week or so, or actually since we're already middle of the week, I guess by the weekend, I'll get an answer to BTB and ask you what that parameter error means. And how I go about fixing that. Because, uh, like I said, from what I've seen and heard out there, BTB is running pretty well right now. And so it must be an error on my part. So I'll look into all that. But these are your latest updates on these sort of quantitative trading platforms that these are operating from. In terms of uh, how they go about producing results and quote-unquote profit for you and so uh, that's that's where it's at here and uh, if anything I'll, I'll give you guys an update and that's why I put these in the high risk category because I've dealt with these sort of things before and um, if you recall last year I looked it up it was about a year ago um, there's a platform called coin hub I made a mistake called it BlockFi Coinage, but it's actually CoinHub, which had a similar sort of structure like this. They did quantitative trading, and man, that was actually a pretty damn good one, but they pulled the rug and stuff on that one, so uh, it was unfortunate, but that was a, that was a really good, and it just was just too bad that uh, it just didn't pan out. Was, yeah, CoinHub was a really good one. Um... But I did that a year ago, and I did it with another YouTuber um, where I did a kind of a, a call, a Zoom call with uh, Rashid. Um, you know, we call him Coach. <laughs> and uh, he, um, you know, we, we did a video together, a collaboration on CoinHub. And, man, the details were so deep, it looked pretty legit you know like but then uh as you you just had to dig even deeper than you ever had to dig to find out that okay maybe it's not you know which was the crazy part you had to dig really deep and i've never seen anything like it before but yeah so this is what it reminds me of but uh tfvpm is doing really well and so i just want to just keep it going you know, keep the flow going but, uh, so that's your latest update on these, and I'm, I'm going to fill you guys in as soon as I know about BTB. 
And so other than that, links down below, comment down below. I'll see you next one.